Hey man, it's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. And listen up, man, we got some very important news about Gym Rat. You're gonna wanna watch this video before you even play 2K, cause this is big news. You need to know about this Gym Rat. It is game change. But before we get into all that, man, y'all make sure y'all like up the video. It is free, it requires very little effort. And it helps out the video a lot. Make sure y'all subscribe if you're new, turn on them goddamn post notices. And yeah, man. <laughs> This supposed to be your moment. This supposed to be your moment. This supposed to be your moment. What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it? So look, I follow this nigga. He's been telling me all about Gym Rat, right? That's why I dropped my other video on Gym Rat, according to him. And I've heard this from other people too. I, didn't, I just didn't know if it was glitched or not. He says, I get to keep my gym rat no matter what build I make after I earn it. Big old W2K, I love it. Now, to be honest, this is a huge W, bro. But wait, let me tell you something else. Guys, listen, you cannot get gym rat in my career anymore. Them 45 games and then winning the championship, at least on next. Some people say it still work on current, but you know, that's big. They didn't tell niggas that. Do not waste your time on next gen playing my career if you don't really want to. There's really no more real incentive. There ain't no gym rat. I mean, I'm sure there's other type of things, but no gym rat, bro. Y'all let me know what um other reasons there are to play my career other than you just don't want to play online and get destroyed because your build not finished type shit. But um yeah, bro, make sure if you got it, if you're close to getting gym rat on, on one build that you stick with that so you get them on all your builds y'all let me know if this works and uh your fastest way to getting gym rat don't talk about it if you did it like a glitch or something uh some niggas is saying right when they do the the drills they they went and did the bench press or the dumbbells and it or the reaction thing and it just lets them keep going they don't have to wait two weeks i'm so confused bro i i don't so we are now having a civil war between content creators we got the big ISO builds and the niggas that fade. Or the niggas that dex and I, I don't know what they're doing now. Cole makes a tweet saying, this is a lot of fucking games, Cole. I ain't gonna hold you, nigga. <laughs> this is a lot of games. He makes a tweet saying, safe to say that there's a skill gap. Mm, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about this, Cole. I don't know about this because... Every year you be having a 90 plus one percent. So I mean, it's kind of like the same thing type shit. Uh, ah. Y'all let me know if y'all think 2K23 has a, a higher skill gap um, than um, previous 2Ks. And y'all let me know which ones you think it has a higher skill gap than. But this shit caused the uproar. Like he started getting hella hate from um, a bunch of old heads telling him to get a life. And <laughs> <laughs> all different type of shit but nigga this is his job what are you talking about he if you niggas knew how much cole makes you you wouldn't say nothing of the sort bro you would be like help me <laughs> so chris zt has now become tuck um with the new installment of uh 2k23 um apparently he's going through a lot of real life issues i don't know man but um a lot of people were saying that this was going to actually happen to uh, creators, man, with the installment of the adrenaline and um, the slow movement, the slow speed boost that a lot of people weren't going to like the game and they was going to be out. I'm sure he's probably going through a, a lot of different things, to be honest. Even Phantom, you know, F Phantom went up and said it, you know, he says, feel like we're going to see a lot of tweets like this from creators in the 2K scene this year but glad you aren't forcing it. Good luck with your video. Chris ZT made a viral tweet, man. It must be a lot of y'all that really hate these six nines, man. It's tough. <laughs> y'all let me know if y'all fuck with them six nines. I just dropped a six nine Demi bill. Y'all go check it out today. I dropped that hoe. Um, with Hall of Fame quick first step. He said, these dudes are saying finally 2K has a skill gap while rim running on a 6'9 ISO build. <laughs> who's saying this? You gotta be talking to Cole. I don't, I don't know who else he could be talking to, man. But then he says, by the way, I forgot to mention 
that I promise this is not a subtweet to anyone laughing my fucking man shut up man nigga we know what it is nigga then he said I saw Cole the man's tweet and this ain't about him he's been good at every 2k this is about those random dudes on Twitter talking about the skill gap and they use six nines you, you gotta be talking about Cole he going crazy on the twos with that big ass build there's a lot of people hating on the six nines um Nate X he does it a lot um, they don't like these uh, do-it-all builds, man, which is like realistic, but um, I personally, I hate when niggas say rim running, bro. Like, I, I, I just know this isn't, I just know that most people who say rim running have like never played like real basketball, bro, at all. Uh, and it, it's so annoying. Just say driving the basketball. Stop saying rim running. Driving is okay. This is a part of basketball. You drive and kick. It's a part of basketball. Your favorite players in the world play like this, bro. Like literally, LeBron, etc. Every great ISO player literally plays like this. You're driving. Rim running, I, I view rim running as just grabbing the ball, holding R2, doing no dribble moves, and just going to go dunk, right? I view that as rim running. But if you're like doing dribble moves and all this and that, and then you go dunk, that's not rim running to me, bro. I don't know, bro. The reason people even drive to dunk is because you're playing them too tight, trying to abuse the defensive system, and uh, you're trying to get a steal and all this other stuff. Scoot back, bro. If niggas is so ass, scoot back, get some defense, bait your defense, act like you're gonna play back, then play up, you know, uh, play real tight, then actually when you start to you know then just go back you know you gotta you have to have your bait you can't just expect to just stay there on somebody i don't know bro young bandit tweeted out next time someone complains about rim running please clip it i guarantee they playing the worst defense ever this is a fact man uh this is why people hate iso in general because it embarrasses them so much that that's why they actually like hate it it's the most embarrassing thing to get ISO'd in front of everyone on the court and everyone watching you if you're streaming or whatever. It's like, it's very like humiliating. It's the best way to humiliate someone. That's why like people like really hate it, you know? There's nothing worse. Cause like with a screen, you could say, oh, you should have did this or you know? So <laughs> there's an uproar and one of uh, Nate X's mods has banned Cole out the stream. <laughs> <laughs> because I guess he's a rim running uh six nine bro and they they had enough <laughs> Nate X he tweeted this out the streets are flooded with ISO six nine so I had to make one of those he is joining the militia all the people saying stop complaining are running double ISO six nine small forward lock slashers <laughs> fucking casuals no steals are broken no matter if you you have them pluckable on gold you get ripped <laughs> y'all let me know how y'all feel about steel so look look so young Tysino man he has confirmed that he is doing an American uh, tour later on to play a bunch of youtubers and shit East Coast and West Coast type shit you know he challenged young Cole saying is this mostly 2v2 we gotta set up a showdown this year, man, you're looking next level. They're gonna set up the wager, man. Who y'all think gonna win? Cole or Tysino? And look at this shit, bro. This nigga Deji is going to fight Floyd Mayweather, bro. I thought this was fake when I first seen this shit, but this is apparently real, bro. This is crazy. This nigga win one fight and this happened. He gets to fight a legend. I'm gonna I'm gonna watch this. It's just, it's gonna be entertaining. I hope Floyd like really like plays with him and then just like did it and it's like really fuck him up type shit, but not too much type shit. But um, bro, I really hope you know Floyd. You're a billionaire, nigga, right? What are you doing? I don't know, bro. Like, I don't, I don't get it. What's he, like, 47 or some shit? I don't fucking know. My nigga, it's like, okay, you could do this. It's light work. It's like a sparring session to fight these niggas. Way less than a sparring session. But, like, what if one of these niggas in, like, five or three years or 
10 years. Like, you can't be in your peak condition forever. What if one of these niggas KO this nigga by like a fluke shit? His whole career will mean nothing. Tyrone Woodley's career is nothing. Nothing. It doesn't matter. Winning that heavyweight championship, having that reign, he used to be one of the top fighters ever. Pound for pound, bro. Diminished. You know, he kind of fucked up at the end of his career, but he had he he was looking pretty unstoppable back in the day, bro. But taking the dive to Jake Paul, a fucking YouTuber, bro? Nah, bro. And then what Anderson finna do? Come on, bro. Your legacy gonna mean nothing. You no longer are the greatest UFC fighter ever. So, I don't know, bro. Anywho, y'all make sure y'all follow me on Twitch, man. Link is in the description. If y'all wanna 1v1 me, play any games with me, COD, 2K, you want a friend invite, y'all make sure to join the channel. I think it's right next to the sub button or click the link in the description. And make sure you click one of these two videos, man. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.